Hi, and welcome to another episode of Pensacola Computers Presents. Today, some more Windows 7 quick tips, and we're going to be focusing on library folders, a great new feature in Windows 7, which allows us to more effectively view and sort through our files and folders. To get to libraries, we open Windows Explorer, and we see we have a default view of our libraries. In previous versions of Windows, we had My Documents, My Pictures, but here we have libraries. Opening up our Documents Library, We'll see there's a couple locations, and we can organize what's in here by the folder, by say the type of file that you've got. Um, you can arrange it by the last modified date, which will show you like last week, earlier this year. So you can view your files in a way that makes sense to you to find things. And you see the documents library holds two locations. By default, it's my documents and public documents. Say we want to add a new location. We click on add. We go find the folder that we want to add click OK and we'll see all of a sudden that we have now within our documents library we have three locations a great way to organize all of our documents from various folders in one place so we can view it all at once now let's say we want to add a new library we click on the new library button type in our name for the library when we open the library we see there's nothing there so we're going to include a folder we go through our directory tree, find the folder that we want to include, click on it, click include folder, and now we've got that folder represented inside of a new library. This is a great way to organize our things so we don't have to go bouncing through Windows Explorer looking for different folders for different files. We can put everything in one place. Thanks for seeing us. Visit us on the web at PensacolaComputers.com.